All right, y'all, it's me, Tina Marie, with True Meaning of Radiance. Today's video is the going out of business sale for Pier 1 Imports. We all love Pier 1, and Pier 1, come on, let's be honest, is expensive. It's very, very expensive. So when you can find good deals on it, you definitely take advantage of it. And with them going out of business, y'all, things are going up to 60% off. I know Joanna said at her store they had things 70 to 80% off. In this area, for some reason, and I went to two different stores, nothing's that high of a percentage off, I guess just because where it's located. But, um, you know, I'll take the 50, 40% off, 60% off on some items because they are so high. But in my opinion, some of those things should have reduced even more to get rid of it. Their online store is now closed, so you cannot buy anything online. And if you have a Pier 1 card, you can still use it. You just cannot make any payments in stores. Don't I sound like I work for them? Yeah, <laughs> but I don't, y'all. This is not sponsored. I just wanted to spruce up my apartment. And why not bring it to you guys in a video style and show you how I spruced up my apartment with Pier 1 for the low, 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 okay? So, yeah, that little cart thing was cute, but it was $1.99, so we kept it pushing. They had candles. It was 20% off. I don't think that's a good deal. I think those candles, if they want to get rid of them, make them 50% off and just get them off the shelves. I mean, come on. They just sitting there. Ain't nobody buying them because they're only 20% off, and 20% is just not a big enough discount, especially with how high Pure One prices are. Like, that little stand thing over there, they wanted, like, what was that, 200 something dollars I was like, for what? It's not even you know, glass or anything like that. I don't know. Some of their prices and some of the things that they try to justify the cost for, it just does not make sense to me. But to somebody, it does. The couches, they had couches going, just so you guys know, for like $600, $700. And they're normally like um, $1,400, $1,500. Outdoor furniture, 60% off. I think that was a really good deal if you like outdoor furniture for your place. Um, I know some people don't believe in having it. I didn't at first, but then I started seeing everybody porches, even at the apartments, and their porches were decked out. I'm like, okay, Tina, it's time to deck out your porch too. So yeah, that 60% really came in handy for me when I did my little shopping spree out there. Entertainment centers, y'all, were on sale. I really was looking at this one. Normally it's $6.99. It was on sale for $3.99. Y'all, I wanted to get this one so bad, but $400, I just couldn't justify the $400 price tag on it, even though it's definitely worth it. Don't get me wrong. It's just the color. I didn't know if it would match perfectly with my apartment, and I just was like, Ugh, do I really want to pay that price? But it still was a good price all in all for that. Did I get it? You guys will find out soon. But yeah, that's uh, $3.99 instead of $6.99. Um, they had some different little entertainment centers. This one right here was going for $3.49. My thing is, why pay $3.49 when you could pay $3.99 and get something that's mirrored furniture? But to each its own. They had the towels that were 25% off. They had rugs that were on sale as well. Y'all, they even had the chairs on sale. But to me, the chairs to me were just not a really good deal. I mean, you're taking chairs that's normally like $2.99. Yeah, you're taking them down to $134. But that's a lot of money for a chair. One of the chairs I'm going to show you that I got when they were doing a clearance out sale uh, for the Georgetown location. I did pay $150 for the chair. I ain't even going to lie. But that's still a lot of money to me for one chair. Like, I don't know. It, it got to be the cheapness in me that thinks that, but it's really a good deal because the chair is normally like 300 something dollars. So you really have to get out of the mindset of being cheap when you come to stores like this because stores like this is very expensive. So you have to get into the mindset um, that you're going to spend a little bit of coin. But office furniture, 50% off. This one was really cute, y'all. 130 like, come on, for that beautiful desk. I mean, that was a really good deal. They had the display one you could have took or you could have went ahead and got um, one that was new in the package. I actually did get this item and I got it new in the package. There are some more chairs. The chairs were going for $69.99. For those, I didn't think those were really cute at all. So we quickly panned somewhere else. So Y'all see, I grabbed my little sticker real quick so I could get that desk because I really had to have that writing desk. It was really pretty. 
more chairs that was a cute chair for 99 dollars. i think it would have went in my room perfectly but again i just didn't want to spend a hundred dollars for a chair i mean that just sounds so expensive a hundred dollars for a chair this is another entertainment center they had normally it's 549 it was the only one they had left and it was going for 249 dollars they had some of the hayworth collection as well this is the hayworth collection not silver on silver but um, it was 50% off, so this was $274. And the dresser that they had, the dresser was going for $399. I did go to another Pure One just to see what they had. This is the one by the Lake Line Mall. Um, just to look at different chairs, because again, I was trying to find a chair, but I just didn't want to pay 100 bucks for a chair. Um, I was able to find one. It ended up being like $45. Now let's show what the Pier 1 import sale did for my home and for the upgrades that I did for my home. So we're just going to go ahead and get started with my den area. Of course, the den area is where they do all the gaming. I work from home in this area. Um, you know, I do my editing in this area. This is just a shared component. This is the desk that was there before. And this is the desk that's there after. This is the writing desk that I showed you guys for the uh, 129 definitely think it's worth it and that chair is the chair i told you i got at the georgetown location when they were going out of business and i got that one for the 154 so i paid more for the chair than i did for the actual desk isn't that crazy when i tell you that is mind blowing and i just have it really girly with the little pops of pink throughout um since this is a shared space um that i do share with the kids so let's move on to the balcony area the balcony area this is kid zone for real you see the water guns you see the mini pool you see the area where they sit and chill um basically there was no organization to this at all it was just thrown together but this is the after y'all i took advantage of the 60 percent off i love tiffany blue y'all know that so i got these uh chairs i got the pillows um they only had one crab pillow it is what it is though um so i have the crab and i also have a starfish and the tabletop was such a good deal it was only 68 dollars. it came with the whole table and that's including the glass top as well the little accessories up there was like less than 20 bucks um and the two chairs they were like 30 something a piece and as you can see the kids still have their little area the only thing that's not out here anymore is the pool the pool is actually in the little storage um unit that is on the balcony now this i picked up it was already put together it was the last one on the floor it did have a little nick in it i didn't even care y'all it was over half off okay original price for this 550 dollars i only paid 250 dollars y'all and guess what <laughs> it's holding the candles of course um so now my candles have a place and they don't have to be in the laundry room or my room anymore but wait there's more yes i have some things that i upgraded in my room if you guys want to upgrade a room tour let me know but this is just the before of what was in this corner um and it was just it's just not as organized as i wanted it to be so this was going for 274 at the lake line location and this was the silver on silver versus that wood color so i picked it up from the hayworth and i also picked up this chair i found the chair that was like like i told you guys 45 dollars, so i picked it up and i got this hayworth i showed you guys a couple weeks ago because nothing was really in this area at all so i went ahead and got this dresser it was only 4.99 versus the regular price of a thousand dollars i still think that is my biggest steal of all of this um so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i love showing you guys the upgrades that i made to my um apartment because this is my last year in this apartment because we're moving on to a house. I'm going to tell you guys right now. So when this lease is up, I believe the lease is up in March. We're out of here and we're getting a house, of course, in the same neighborhood. But it's time to get a home. So I hope you guys enjoyed everything. All this stuff will be coming with me to my home. But it was so nice to just do a little spoiling of myself and spoiling of my place and sprucing it up. Because you need to spruce up especially if you can do it for the low low so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want to update apartment tour definitely let me know i can definitely get one to you i appreciate all you i thank you guys for being subscribers to the channel anything you want to see on the channel definitely let me know in the comments below i am working on more bath and body work content i know that is what y'all are all about and that's what y'all love i know y'all but there's only so much bath and body i can bring you okay 
there's other things in the world too. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you enjoyed something a little bit different with decorating. I'll do clean with me videos. I like watching those. If y'all want to see me do some clean with me videos, I can show y'all some clean with me videos. Having three kids, you got to clean a lot. So I can definitely bring y'all those as well. But I'm rambling, so I'm going to get off here. Remember, rate, comment, subscribe. Check out Pier, Pier 1. If you went to Pier 1, definitely let me know what you purchased below. How much did you save? And did you feel good when you left? So I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, guys.